Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you about animation in Unity. Um, there's many ways you can do this. You can use JavaScript, C, um, or you no, know, you can use an external program like Blender and Maya. I think Maya is one. But uh, today I'm going to use the built in animator. So, what uh, right here, I just have something to test. This is going to rotate like that, kind of like a camera on a wall. So what you want to do is click window and animation. Now, like, uh, let me just delete this stuff. This is only the basics because the built-in animation can be kind of tricky and confusing, even if you've done it for a while. Because I've been doing this for a while, but still, just a little confusing. Now, before I start, I want to tell you about this. This uh, right now is in seconds. It's every half second, so thirtieth of second. Then you got a second, second and a half. You can zoom in, so you can get like twentieth of a second, or you can zoom out to get uh, let me see a full second, or you know five seconds. All depends how you like it. I prefer. Well, hold on. In order to see that, you gotta have animation going. <laughs> okay, I prefer where it's 30th of a second, then a second. And, uh, yeah. So let's get started. First thing you want to do is click your object and press record button here it'll ask you to save it so this can be like reload animation whatever you want I'm just going to put test now here's where it can get a little tricky um, I'm not going to go into a lot of detail I'm just going to show you how to do it um, when you first start out you would assume that it's, your animation is going to start like this Okay, as soon as you play the game, it's going to start like this and start maybe turning that way or something. Well, that's not the case. What happens is with the Unity built in, you got uh, what I do is you, let's say, a second. You have to click that, turn, and that's going to take however long you put here. So I put second. Uh, let's click that second, turn it this way. Now watch, watch where it starts. See, it starts uh, there. It um, stop this, stop that. It didn't start. Oh, see, I, I really don't like this. Um, it didn't start right. Stupid thing, right here like it was supposed to. So and. A way to bypass. Okay, so a way to bypass that is really just to put the red line as close as to the beginning of the line as you can. That's where you can zoom all the way in if you want. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to put it right there and just move it just a little bit. So it's going to start right there. Now for the turning. Um, I want this to turn maybe let's do two and a half seconds to the right so what I'll do is I click this and turn it it's lagging so I got a bunch of stuff going on and let's put it to the other side now if it took me two and a half seconds to get from the middle to there if I put another two and a half seconds would be 430 something like that 5 whatever I'm not be doing math no 3 uh, yeah whatever it would go from okay, 2 half seconds would be 4 so it would go from here to here in 2 half seconds that would be fast because if you imagine it um here let me show you I'm not trying to get mathematical here, but it's really just 
animation. It's going from here to the right in two and a half seconds. If you may go from the right to the left, two and a half seconds, not only is that going to look odd, that's going to be extremely fast. So what you'll want to do is either bring that back to middle and add two and a half seconds to that, or just add force. Uh, so in order to get it from right to left, looking smoothly, you'll want to get uh, around six uh, six minutes, not six minutes, six six seconds and a half. So let's just bring that over here. Let's just Okay, let's see how that looks. Um, that may have been way too much. I think it was supposed to be like five seconds. Okay, it's going there. Okay, we're having that problem now. Hey guys, here's a second reason why I say that Uni animation is tricky. Because when you go to test out your animation and press play, see how it snaps back to the beginning? That's because you're in Uni. It only plays what you uh, what you have visible here. So in order to fix that, all I have to do is zoom out or just follow that. Like I said, uh, it only plays what it has visible. See. So let's get that fixed. Okay, let's fix. It. Okay, back to what I was saying. Two and a half. Two and a half there. Two and a half back. As you can see, that's not. I didn't go all the way. That, that didn't turn as much as that did, but this is only a test. So that's basic animation for Uni. Um, I'm. Get, you can do this. This isn't only for turning, you can make stuff fly, you can like have rocket ship blasting off. You can have you can make reload animations, character walk animations, but a little word of advice, use a different program like Blender or Maya. It's just a lot better and easier, I guess you could say. But this was made as a request, request by somebody who's doing turret games, so that's why it's I had it like that because I would resemble a turret. So that's pretty much an easy way to do it. Having questions, post in the comment box. Subscribe for more and for more space updates. And have fun.